What is up, everybody? It's your boy Dano's Vlogs here, guys. How y'all doing today? Um, so today is a whole different video, guys. I decided to work on a video that I've been wanting to work on for a long time. Haven't had a chance to do it. Been doing a lot of GFO content, like I said in my last video. A lot of GFO players have been coming out left and right. But today, with this is a video I've been wanting to work on for a long time. And I do got me some G Fuel to drink because I gotta have my G Fuel in my videos just because I want some G Fuel and I love G Fuel. I got Prickle Pear in here. Um, I will put a link uh, down in the description down below so you can check out my video on this Prickle Pear flavor that I did like I think a few weeks ago or a few months ago. A great video, great flavor. I'll put a link down in the description for you. But let's do this. So, what I mean by this is gonna be a different video. This is my top five favorite Nintendo Switch games. Um, I play a lot of Nintendo Switch. You guys probably know me as playing Xbox, but guys, when I don't feel like playing my Xbox, I got to play my Nintendo Switch. I love my Nintendo Switch. I have it turned on now. been playing a lot of these games that that is in my hand recently. I've only got three physical copies, and the other two I'm just going to explain, and then there will be pictures up there. Um, so, anyway, so this is how my order goes. We're going to do the top five. We're going to go from, uh, like, not been playing it as much but still really enjoy it to like a game I've been going ham on. So starting with number five, this one's probably gonna get probably a lot of comments down below saying, oh this is a weird list, this is so stupid, and nah, this, this is a bad choice for you. Yeah, well people have different opinions guys. Um just gonna throw that out there. I have a different opinions on certain games. Um especially on Switch. I'm um, unfortunate I don't have anything Nintendo stuff so you get this red and white shirt I'm trying to make mixed up his hat. But anyway, so Number five, I have not been playing this game very much, but I do play it. Um, I just lost interest in it after they stopped doing DLC and everything. It's just I beat the storyline to it. And this is Smash Bros. Ultimate. So Smash Bros. Ultimate was one of the original games that came out on the Nintendo Switch. Um, I remember when this game came out, it was it was pretty exciting. I was excited for it. And I still am excited to play it. So... Um, I love this game. It's still fun to play. I just have not been playing it much like I'm supposed to. I've been playing other games besides Smash Bros. Ultimate, but I do love this game very much. Um, I just love playing it. I just love playing, you know, as the Mario characters and just playing as, like, freaking Link or freaking Kirby, uh, Ness. These are all the Nintendo characters I grew up playing, like, on 64, Super, Mario, Super Smash Bros. Nintendo 64, and uh, the others from there on up. So, this one is one of my favorites. Um, big fan of the Smash Bros. series. Grew up playing it with my sister all the time. And I, I still love it. I just have not been playing it very much um, like I used to. But I do love playing Smash Bros. Still, this is number five. On to number four. This one I don't have a physical copy of. I've been playing this. I used to play it all the time. I don't have a physical copy for it. I had to, you know, uh, trade it in for rent money. But I do miss playing it. But the good thing is I could just re-download it because I got the digital and the physical copy, but I don't have the physical copy, but I do have the digital. And it is Super Mario 3D All-Stars. Uh, there'll be a picture of that right here. Um, when that game came out, guys, I was so pumped. When it has Super Mario Sunshine, Super Mario Galaxy, um, and Mario 64, like, guys, th those three games on the... On the like on the SD card that the games come with, it was awesome. I still play the game. Um, I love playing it. Just playing Super Mario Sunshine takes me back to my GameCube days um, when I had a Nintendo GameCube. Um, Super Mario Sunshine was one of my favorite game games of all times. Um, so when they uh, like announced it for Switch with 64, Sunshine, and Mario Galaxy, I was so pumped. So that's number four for y'all. Picture will be right here. On to number three. So, guys, another one I don't have a physical copy of. Um, Splatoon 2. Okay. I, ha I have been playing Splatoon 2 a lot. Like, I have it uh, digitally on my Switch. I, I love playing Splatoon 2. I, I played Splatoon when it was on the Wii U. And I waited so long to get it for Wii, uh, the Switch. And I, I was able to get it because at that time when I purchased it, it was on sale. It was on sale for like $25, I think, at the time. And now it's like back up to 60 or something like that. I forgot what it was. But, guys, Splatoon 2, the Splatoon series, man, I love it. I, I've been playing a lot of Splatoon 2. Um, 
Splatoon has always been one of my favorite games of all time since when they first announced it on the Wii U. The graphics is great, the gameplay is great, uh, the controls are fantastic, the lobbies, they are very competitive, uh, I love it. So that's one of the things I love about the Splatoon series. So that is number three. Drink break, gotta have that drink guys, it is hot today, so I got myself like some, some prickly pears, it's a hot day today. It's going to be around 90 later on in the week. Yep, 90 on Father's Day. So, which is good because the last few days we've had a lot of rain. So, I'm pumped about these heat, the heat. Anyway, so, on to my top two. The two main games I've been playing. And these games have been have been great. Have just came out or came out a long time ago or a year ago or whatever. Um, so, number two, guys... I am pretty excited to announce this. Splatoon 3 gets number 2. When this game came out, I had to wait almost a year to get it because I had to get a lot of other things caught up before I picked this up. Um, Bills wise, if you guys know what I'm talking about. Adult life. Anyway, <laughs> so Splatoon 3. So guys, this game, it has all I want. The controls, new weapons, um, competitive gameplay. Sometimes there's people that can find a way to, I guess, you could say cheat somehow, but I forget all that. Take all that out of the side, play the game yourself, go pick it up. It's still available to pick up, obviously. Go to your local game store, go pick it up. I love this game. It's actually in my Switch right now. As you can tell, I don't have the card in there. Um, I love Splatoon 3. I was so pumped for it, and let's just say I got this as a late birthday present. Um, I've been wanting to get it for a long time since it was announced. Um, I never got a chance to go pick it up until recently, and guys, you have got to try this game. If you have not tried it yet, go do it. If you have, let me know your opinion on it, but this is my opinion. This is a game I've been going ham on. I love playing this game so much. It was going to be number one, but I have another one game that I always love and always will hold a special place in my heart, but this game right here takes number two. Number one. Number one. This game holds a special place in my heart. Always have, always will. Um, I love this game. This is all I play when I'm not playing Spot 2 or 3 on my Switch. Um, and you guys, I used to, I love golf. So, um, I play golf too. So, number one for this Switch countdown Mario Golf Super Rush. Guys, let me, let me explain to you guys something real quick about this game. When this game was announced, I was one of the first people to pre-order it. I pre-ordered it, I had to get it because Mario Golf 64 and Mario Golf Toadstool Tour hold special places in my heart. I love those two games. Those were my two games I grew up playing as a child. And it took them so long for them to come out with this game. Um, I, I'm so glad it came out. I knew they were gonna work on another Mario Golf game eventually at that time, and here it is, Mario Golf uh, Super Rush. Guys, let me explain to you. This game has two ways you can play. You can use Joy-Cons and hold like a golf club and swing like you did on the classic Wii. Um, or you can use a controller to play it. Um, so, guys, the power-up's great. The the gameplay, the, the, the maps, the competition, online, the characters you can unlock, all of that stuff. This game is where it's at. If you guys are stressed after a long stressful day, go play this because Mario Golf Super Rush is pretty fun. If you guys have not played it yet, go pick it up. If you have, give me your opinions on it. But my opinion is this is my number one favorite game because this is what I love playing. Um, especially when you can go up to online and do ranked and to get new like characters unlocked, um, which they don't even do that anymore because this game hasn't had an update in so long. But besides the point, this game has great graphics, great gameplay, great controls. Um, you guys have got to try yourself. I know it's hard to find now. I was at I was up at Target the other day and I was looking for this game and they only have one One copy of it left for switch then GameStop has like maybe two or three left it's like that's new um, People are serious when it comes down to these Mario games. I, I'm just telling you right now I uh, just you guys have got to try this game yourself like I have had this game for a long time now and I almost have all the golf clubs unlocked so, I'm, I've am i done Mario and Down, and now I'm working on Cooper Troopers to get his Superstar uh, Clubs. And that's that's one thing I love about it. You can play as much as you want to get, as long as you get the points to get the Superstar Clubs, so I, I love it. So, um, go pick it up, guys, if you have not tried it yet. Um, 
Let me know what you think about it. I recommend it. I gave this game a 10 out of 10. I love it. Um, I didn't rank the others because this one has, holds a special place in my heart. Um, so, guys, I have my opinions on it. Go try it yourself and you'll see why. It is so fun. It is it's so fun. So I have two honorable mentions for y'all um, for the countdown. I didn't put them in that they came this close to me in the countdown. But these are my two honorable mentions. This was a kind of it was like I said, it was kind of a hard choice to pick these games because I played so much Switch games. And I know there's a tons more out there, you know, that I could play, but I'm gonna be picking up more eventually. I'm on I I wanna I've played Breath of the Wild. Was not good enough to, for me. I mean, Breath of the Wild, Zelda Breath of the Wild was fun and all, but it just, I couldn't get into it very much. It's not like how it used to be with the classic of Zeldas. Um, I know that a lot of people liked it. Um, so, I might have to go pick up the new one just to see how it's like. Um, it might be better. I mean, my, one of my friends that I talked to, he said that uh, it's one of the greatest, the new Zelda game is awesome. He loves it. So, I might have to go try it myself. He said, dude, you need to go try it. So, I might have to go pick it up eventually and try it. But anyway, so these are my two honorable mentions. Now, you're probably thinking, why honorable mention? Why not, why, instead of doing top five, why not do top ten? Because, guys, obviously, <coughs> it's top five. And I can't put, put all the games that I want to put in the countdown. But that does not mean I'm going to be stopping this countdown. I'm just seeing how this goes. If I get more good views on it, then I'll do it again. But I might, if I get enough views, I'll probably go up to top ten, maybe top fifteen, or maybe to top twenty. Just got to see. But anyway, so... This is my first honorable mention. Now, when this game came out, me and my sister grew up playing this game all the time. From 64 to GameCube to Wii to now to Switch. And then, of course, the OLED, OLED Switch. I still want to try that, get that to the OLED Switch. I want to try that. I still got the classic Switch. Um, but anyway, so one of, the th one of the games that me and my sister grew up playing that we love playing the most, and I mean the most as our growing up as brother and sister, was the Mario Party series. So... When the two Mario Party series games came out for the Switch, we were like, hmm, this looks like it'll be fun. This looks like this would be something that me and my sister will enjoy playing. Um, so, two Mario Party games came out on Switch, like, a long time ago. So, not too far long ago, but this one is Super Mario Party Superstars. Mario Party Superstars. Picture of me right here. Um, so... Basically, guys, Mario Party Superstars is just like, you know, Super Mario All-Stars or whatever it was. I said 3D All-Stars. Um, forgot the name of it already because I... <laughs> so, anyway, so this one has the classic maps, classic mini games, and guys, it is so fun. Like, I've played it so much. I've even unlocked all the, like, bonus, all the mini games on it. That's how much I've played it. Um, so, guys, go pick up Mario Party Superstars. Picture of it will be right here. Um, and just go try it yourself, guys. It is so fun. I also tried the other Mario Party that came out uh, as well uh, before Mario Party Superstars. So before I get to that last honorable mention, what I mean by the other Mario Party that came out before Mario Party Superstars was Super Mario Party. Picture right here. Be right here. So Super Mario Party uh, came out uh, for Switch, and it was so fun like I was pumped about it um, when it came out um, back in 2021 it was the first one that came out before they did Mario Party Superstars um, this game was released October 29th 2021 um, when this came out I was wanted to try it and give it a go so I picked it up and played it it's really fun but not as good as Mario, Mario Party Superstars um, so make sure you guys go check it out um, it's totally worth it guys I mean, you can get them both, both Mario Parties if you want, um, because they're both fun. Um, but yeah. So, this is the final honorable mention for y'all. Now, guys, the reason why I did not make this on my countdown is because it's basically a game that I could play whenever I want to. I kind of lost interest in it. Now, now that after I heard they released a lot of DLC, I want to go get it again. And probably put them back in my account. There's a lot of cool DLC that came out for this certain game. And Mario Kart Deluxe. So that is my honorable mention for that one. So about that one, guys. The reason why that one is an honorable mention is, like I said, I lost interest in it. It's not that I didn't hate the game. It's just, it's just so different. Like, I like different, but it's kind of hard to explain. Um, it just, it's a fun game. It's just something that I didn't really play that much. 
Um, and that was before I found out they released a lot of DLC. So now I have to go pick up some DLC for it. Um, and I'll pick it back up and, you know, one thing I like about playing it, it's a family game. You can play your family on it online. Um, but, like, nothing will beat Mario Kart Double Dash. Um, that was probably one of my favorite Mario Kart games of all time, was Mario Kart Double Dash. Um, so, yeah, guys, so that's all my honorable mentions for y'all. Alright, guys, so that's it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you guys thought about my countdown, alright? Because I want to know how this video does. If this video does good and I get a, quite a good views on it, then... I'll do another part of it, but for right now, this is my only part I'm going to do, um, so thank you guys so much for watching, I am so pumped that I finally was able to get this video started, I've been wanting to do it for quite a long time, and I never got a chance to get around to it, but now I got time too, so I was able to go ahead and throw that out there for y'all, um, so yeah guys, that is it for this video, quick little update for y'all, um, we were going to vlog today, but we were really busy today, so uh, sorry about that. Um, we got in a, we'll be doing a vlog really soon. Um, and, uh, I have more videos that got scheduled to work out that I'm going to release. I actually have my own like composition book to write down what videos I want to uh, put out. And I check it off when it's out. Um, so um, it's, very help, it's very helpful for people who have YouTube channels. You know, that's one way you can you know, keep track of all your videos that you have uploaded. Um, get yourself a composition book. Write down videos that you want to release. And so when you release them, check them off. Um, and it helps me stay track of my YouTube and it helps me not get like stressed with making different videos from left and right because um, it, it, it is it is very stressful for making videos if you don't have uh, a composition book it's like scatterbrain so I don't want to do that to my health I don't want to mess my videos up so that's why I write them down um, so yeah so thank you guys so much for watching like, like I said let me know what you thought about my countdown and please give me the likes and comment down below what your your favorite switch games are and maybe i should try them so anyway guys thank you again so much and i hope you guys have a great day um i'm probably not gonna upload this weekend because it's father's day this weekend so i'm gonna get this video like started as soon as i'm done with it and get it uploaded before uh sunday so because of, of course father's day sunday is between my dad so Anyway, guys, you guys have a great day, and I hope you guys have a great weekend, and guys, a little friendly thing for y'all. I know we are going through a lot nowadays, but go spend time with your father on Father's Day. All right, guys? Um, go do stuff with your dad, um, because dads are awesome. So my dad's awesome, too. So you guys, go spend time with dads this weekend. Go do some stuff. Go, cook, go on a cookout. Go camping. Go do something with your dad this weekend. Give him a hug. Tell him you love him, and... Tell him thank you for all he's done for you. All right, guys. So thank you again. Watch. Thank you again for watching. I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace. Peace.